Uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is the last day of February, February 28th of 2017. Uh, you may remember, I did a review of the Sadie's gaming headset, the SA902. This is the new version of the SA902. And uh, let me show you the box. So let's open this up. See what we have here. Well, can't open it up. Have to give up on this. Can't be opened. Okay, empty box. There's some silica in there to absorb moisture. There is a DVD, and it's a full-size DVD in here. I'm going to have to remember to mark on this DVD what this goes with, because I have several DVDs laying around here. For some reason, the little ones. And I get, stuff gets sidetracked, not where it's supposed to be. And, uh, I better, let's see if it might say on it, but most of them don't, especially the small ones. Well, yeah, it's very dark, blue on black. I don't think it says, it says, uh, Sadie's, and it says driver, uh, S-A, or it says, 7.1 something gaming headset. We need to leave that out, don't we? Okay. I think this is the nice braided cable, but I think that I think this is the one. Is this the headset that this dragging across my shirt was picked up by the microphone? I think that this might be the one. Not sure. I guess we'll find it. looks like it's nice and long. This is a USB. Ouch. Shouldn't pick it up like this, but... Okay. Yeah, that's nice and long. And there's a controller here for shutting off the mic or shutting off the uh, headset or going up and down with the volume in the headset. Sadie's, this is the left because it says left and this says right. Feels good over the ears. I wonder if I'm supposed to run the driver first or plug it in and then run the driver. Uh, does anybody speak Chinese? Chinese? Chinese. There's not, that, there's not that many Chinese people in the world. I, I think, isn't uh, China one of the smallest countries with the smallest population? Uh, English. Let's see. The driver program. Pre-installed, you must open application to save and exit so as to avoid data loss after installation. Turn on your computer. Put the CD in the CD-ROM automatically. 
enter the installation or read the disk file setup.exe is found click the mouse click the next and blah 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 and did that answer my question I don't know does it say looks like there's a nice uh, control thing microphone settings all kinds of stuff okay I'm going to plug this in right here this isn't where I would normally wouldn't do it on the front of the computer. Ah, it recognized it, but let's see. That's okay. See if it pops up here. I just put okay, click on this. You don't they, they don't give you much time. Okay. That's no fault of uh, that's my computer. No fault of the um Sadies or this disc. So I've gotta go find this C D, okay. Drive H. Okay, um, Windows 10, Setup. Yes. Nope, this is what I want here. Say D7 point, I can't, too fast. Welcome, okay. I accept the terms. Okay, install. 7.1 sound gaming effects headset driver. Looks like a nice, sometimes you have problems with these, with headsets. Well, I think a lot, some of the headsets in the past weren't, uh, didn't have the drivers for Windows 10 or something. So it looks like this is going to be a good install. Unless I end up, unless you end up losing my audio because it's going to find, we'll have to check that, because it's going to find, okay, okay, well, I have to restart the computer, so I'm going to have to, uh, I'm going to have to shut down this video, and I'll be back. So, stop. Okay, I am back, and I think everything is working okay, except this uh, right away setup for, which is good, setup for the, uh, the headset. So it disabled my speakers, and it disabled my Yeti microphone, but you can go into settings and change it. That's I've discovered that pretty much happens when you install. So I haven't looked at it yet, but uh, I saw it in the tray. Here is the Sadie 7.1 gaming headset software. 
and there's a volume thing that pops up, but I think I maybe I'll click again, I'll get the entire, yeah, here we go. Output selection device, okay, I think that's already going to exit that. So here we have the volume control, so this must be for, I don't think this is for the speaker, I think this is, checks microphone as the default device, and the headset is the default device, that's good. Up here is the information. Um, if I click on the headset, do I get something? If I click on the microphone? Okay, volume control for mic in, monitor. I'm going to kick up where, you know, I'm using this microphone, by the way. I'm going to kick this up. I won't know what you hear, but I'm going to kick it up here. All the way at the top. Testing one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. It might be really too loud or something, so I'm going to go back down because I can't tell. I can't monitor it. Well, I could if I wanted to put it back to 76. Okay, uh, microphone, let's see, headset. Okay, um, I don't know if there's anything else. Oh, let's see, some settings up here. What's this? Showing the system tray, English. Okay. Cancel. Okay. Uh, let me show you the settings. This is Windows 10. And you go up here and type in the start of sound. This pops up. So it shows, it calls it a USB audio device, but you can go in and, as this is the headset being used, it shows it as a default device. You can go in, of course, and change that. So this is a test of it. I don't know if you're gonna hear it or not. Um, if you heard that, it was because of coming through the system, not through my speakers, because they're disabled, but through. Um, so, um, so you configure properties, okay. So here I could rename this to headset uh, SA902. I could also change the icon to the headset. Let's see, I'll change it to that one. Levels, speaker level, microphone. Oh, the microphone level is way down. I'm going up with the microphone level. You all notice any difference? I don't. I'm going to go up a little bit higher. I'm going up to, let's go to 60, let's go to 69. Effects, so we could have some effects apparently. I don't know if I want to do that. Advance, spatteral sound format. I have no idea what that is. I'm sure if I clicked it, it would uh, probably mess everything up. May have already messed everything up. I may be talking to myself. What did we want to do? We want to go to, oh, okay, recording. So we're going to go to the microphone. Shows it moving here, but I don't know if I can trust this. I've found in the past that it's, uh, let's see, properties. We can have echo. I wonder what, okay, I'm going to have to try this. Magic voice. Okay, testing one, two, three, four, five. Maybe I have to push the apply. Testing one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Hopefully I'm back out of whatever the magic voice was. Sound, communications, okay. Uh, close this. 
what do I need to tell you now? Well, I guess I'm going to have to stop. Oh, I know what I want to do, though. Now, you can go to YouTube and, they, and put in uh, 7.1, test 7.1 surround sound. They have a whole bunch of different ones. I don't know which one's the best one, but I'm going to pick this one here. Now, I don't know if you're going to hear... I know you're not going to hear it from the headsets, but I may have the system audio cranked up a little bit, but I want to hear this so I can tell you. So let's see. Wait a minute. It looks like it's already been. I think I've been here before. Yeah. Okay, I don't hear anything, but I guess maybe that's because I don't have a whole set of... Oh, left. That really sounds like center. Definitely right. Now, I probably won't hear the rest of these. Yeah, I do. Wow. It really sounds authentic. That sounds like it's coming from right back here. I think that sounds like it's maybe there. Okay. Don't want to do too much of that, though. Probably. Well, I wasn't sure. Maybe it might be covering you up. I mean, it might. Also, I don't want them to say that their noise is copyrighted noise or something. I don't know. Okay. So, um, I want to hear Madonna. Yeah, I'll do that later. The sound is great. Now, the only thing I don't know about is the microphone, so. But anyway, here you see it's USB. Microphone goes up and down. Oh. Do you hear this? Well. I guess I need to stop and listen to the audio from this recording, and then I'll come back for a final. So don't touch that mouse. I positively do not touch that mouse. Okay. Okay, I'm back. I went and listened to the, I watched the video part two, and I am impressed. I think this is the best of the headsets that I have ever. SA and the SA902 before was good, and this is, I guess, the new and improved SA902, and it is great. The I think I'm actually going to be using this microphone instead of my Yeti. Uh, I know the yeti 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 yada yada yada. I know this is a great microphone. Well, let me know what you think, but I think I'm just going to start using this. Um, I didn't really notice any problem with the 
like I did before on one of the headsets where a cord was making a lot of noise rubbing. I think the audio is great now and it's picking up sounds from around here. Uh, you may have heard the air conditioning I think running a little bit at one time and I heard some traffic. I really don't mind that. Um, I mean, uh, you're not, you're supposed to want to eliminate all that. I don't have a, you know, I like the wide view camera here so you can see where I am, what's going on around here. Uh, I kind of like, I, I know you heard me typing on the keyboard, but I think I'm just going to use for, of course, you know, I change all the time, but I think, uh, I'm going to use this headset. Now I won't be, I very rarely listen to anything on the head, on the headphones, but I'm going to be using the speaker. So I'll use this headset when I'm making a video and, uh, I think in every department, now I have hearing loss in both ears. I'm not good at judging. There'll be other people that can, that are, I mean, there's people that really hear things well and music and they know music and they know sound and their opinion would be much better than mine. But from uh, my point of view, I think this is an excellent headset microphone I actually like it um, I like the real you know the real sound uh, might change my mind my I live alone right now but here in a week or so maybe less gonna have my ex-wife and my grown son moving in and my grown son will be having his computers going and my ex-wife will have her TV going 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and she keeps it loud. So I may change my mind. But as of right now, this is, uh, I give this five stars for sure. Uh, I'll put a link below where you can buy it, please. If you're going to buy it, please use that link because uh, I will get a commission from Amazon. Oh, this video is going to be um, on YouTube, but and that's kind of with my mindset. I'm talking to YouTubers here, but I'll also use this video on Amazon. So if it's if you're at the Amazon site watching an Amazon review, uh, <laughs> there won't be any link below for me to get a commission. But if you're YouTube, please buy. If, you, if you're going to buy it, please buy it so I get a little commission. Okay, thank you very much for watching.